What's going on, guys? It's Will from TechBeat TV, bringing to you an unboxing and first look of the Odyssey Lower East Side Media Speakers. So these speakers can connect to pretty much any device you can think of, whether it be your HD TV, your Apple TV, your Mac Mini, in my case, or your PC. You'll be able to get really good audio out of these things. I've used them for a little while now, and they sound pretty awesome. You'll see some audio samples uh, a little bit later in the video. But Odyssey likes to keep things simple, so really the packaging that they included and all the stuff that they included in it was kind of limited. So the first thing you'll get, obviously, is some warranty information, which they provided on a very, very tiny pamphlet um, that kind of limits and uh, shows you all the different um, warranty information in various languages, uh, but you should be good to go. Just bring a magnifying glass to go read them. And they also incorporate a quick start guide to kind of show you how to set up your speakers. I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory, but just in case uh, you have some nice pretty diagrams that you can use to uh, set up these speakers. But inside is the main uh, course uh, for this particular video. It is the speakers themselves. And as you can see, they're huge. Um, these things are really big for kind of media speakers that you use for your PC or your TV. They uh, take up quite a bit of space, surprisingly. Uh, they do give you some cables that connect the two, and I'll show you that in a little bit, but the audio cable they give you is kind of short. So if you're looking to connect it through an aux jack or a line-in, um, you might want to think about placement because the cable's not that long. Uh, these speakers are also unique in that they give you speaker cable to connect the two. It's not a fixed cable from one plugging into the other. They do give you speaker cable that you can use to connect the two together or swap it out with some longer speaker cable a little bit later if you've got a different type of setup um, or your desk's a little bit wider or you want to put the speakers elsewhere. You can just swap out the speaker cable um, later on to get more length out of them. The brick, as you can see, is freaking huge. Um, these are self, uh, these need to be powered via a separate power source. It's not USB powered, which is good because the audio coming out of them is a lot better that way. Um, they do give you a nice length unlike the audio cable so you should be able to get um, pretty good distance and set up for this via the power cord but the brick will take up a good amount of space the speakers themselves great quality right out of the box I mean the finish on them the fit and finish absolutely great um, they got some weight on them which is good uh, so they won't be vibrating or doing or moving much at all especially at higher volume levels. And they give you some speaker stands that are incorporated right into the design that they have some dampening qualities because uh, it's got these kind of rubber feet. It'll keep them from moving. Also dampens a little bit of the vibrations. With Odyssey, the controls are kept very simple as well. On the front, you'll have your power button, which also functions as your volume control. Found it nice and clean in the design, and the adjustments are nice and easy. You'll be able to see a, a power on and off LED that'll pop up to show you whether the speakers are in operating mode or not, or in standby. Um, connection and setup for them was relatively easy. Uh, again, with the length of the cables they provided with the audio, um, as well as the speaker cable they also provided, your setup might be limited in how uh, far apart these speakers can be set up. But let's listen to some of the uh, audio samples from out of the speakers so you can kind of hear what they're all about. <laughs> Hopefully that audio sample uh, gave you some idea of kind of how these speakers sound. These are going to be my media speakers probably going forward um, as I use and set up my new office. Again, guys, more videos to come. Uh, make sure you're subscribed to the channel in order to see all those videos. Hit your sub box as soon as they get released. And if you can like and favorite this video, I would really appreciate it. Helps me out. And I'll talk to you guys real soon in the next video. Later.